will nothing save us from this unholy curse. There is a curse upon every man across this dark and dangerous land. No one can run, no one can hide from the perils of B.O. B.O., B.O., nothing we do will make it go. Old Spice does not yet exist, so everyone smells quite all. But in 700 years, when the gods of smell see fit, long life... Uh, wait, I know, I know. Did you just I, realize? I just realized that an ad was playing while I was on a phone call. That's why it took me so long to begin. But hi, hello, everyone. Uh, wait, for, can you chat hear us? Can, yeah, chat, chat real quick. Can you, hold on, speak, someone speak? Uh, okay, it's coming through on the audio output capture, so I'm gonna assume. Cool. All right, uh, bestie in the chat, I refunded funded them for oh, you. Oh, okay, me. thank you. I felt really bad when I saw them uh, do that, and I, I didn't I didn't realize we were on a D and D stream. Okay, cool. We can all hear. Uh, so we hello, can. hello everyone. Um, so Hi. I guess firstly, uh, we we are running on a bit of a limited clock, but that's okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> just a Zamac. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, explain firstly what this is. So first off, if you're here from Ramarana Vaman, this is completely disconnected from Ramarana Vaman. This is not anything connected to it at all. This is a one shot. We're just gonna be having a completely disconnected one shot. Some things might come back and reconnect later, but we'll see. I'm gonna be doing this every other Friday, so two of these a month, so I can prepare because I've actually prepared quite a bit for this um for this uh one shot tonight uh tonight the one shot uh and no i did not name this one i did not name any of the ones i'm using actually uh i'm grabbing ones from all sorts of different places uh this one is grammy's country apple pie uh weird name i know but Wow, that map's a little smaller than I thought. Uh, I, I made maps for every single location uh, instead of just the important ones. So we'll be having a lot of fun with that today. So I guess I should get started on how this, uh, this adventure is going to come about. The five of you... Yeah, we've got five of you here. The five of you are all people from... Vi okay, the bar doesn't count. And I don't count. Just things they say in a math game. No, I'm just saying, you're just like, five, five. <laughs> okay. Five, maybe. And maybe the five. five of you have are from all different corners of whatever world this takes place in. But what you all do share in common, at least for what you know right now, is one day when you were at your home, you got a letter. And this letter was from A1 Tynadaris the Green. This man asked you to come to a certain tower far, far away from where you lived, and he promised you a job, a proposal, a gig. The wording was different in between each letters, but the point that you got across was the fact that there was money involved. And now, Is after... A proposal? No. Did after some, after some time of I traveling, did. all five of you are now at the door of Tynadaris' house, awaiting for anyone to come in. The tower is tall and made of stone and brick. Uh, there's no windows, so you can't see anything going on inside. And the large cone top makes it hard to see anything happening atop, but you could have sworn you saw a window at the very top of this wizard's tower. Um, all five of you are at the door, kind of waiting awkwardly. Uh, do you all want to go one by one, describe your characters in a little bit of a quicker fashion, since this is a one-shot? Let's go Just first. start from the top. Augustine, you want to go first? Excuse me. <laughs> you go first? Uh, sure. I'll go first. Uh, hi, everybody. You know me. That's Faith. Because I'm not really. No, describe your um, I'm like Augustine, a... I'm playing a deep gnome uh, mastermind rogue. Um, he's a little disheveled. Uh, by me a little, I mean a lot. But um, he's he's worked a couple jobs before. Any, anything else? Any defining other features? <laughs> or you just want to end it there? Do you not have my thing that shows every part of my features? What do you or do I have to describe every stream. creeping part? That's that's not for stream. That's it. you you got anything you also want to share with the stream. Yeah. Sorry. 
Th that's okay. it? What the um, fuck do you mean? That's all right. Anything else you want to say to the stream about your character? Um... Sorry. <laughs> like, how they look, or... Um... Well, like I said, he's disheveled. He's very, like... You would think he would be a zombie when you first looked at him. He's got, like, a ripped, like, little portion wow, of his mouth. Wow, zombie on zombie stream? Oh, okay. Let explode. He has a little <laughs> ripped part of his, uh, chin, where his, like, teeth and gum are kind of exposed, so his toothy grin's a lot more of, like, a, a grin on one half, and the other half's not. His nose is, like, a bit, like, chopped. He's been through a lot as a, as a smuggler. Alright, uh, do we wanna, Woo! do we wanna move on then? Uh, care. I'm yeah, so sorry. So I'm so how 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 <laughs> character have a nickname? How that's it. <laughs> how? Yeah. How did you get? That? How do you say the name? <laughs> how did I get here? Don't worry about it. Can I just call hey, you bro broth? Broth because I can't. Broth. I love broth. Okay, describe your character broth. for me, Kiwi. <laughs> White dragonborn artificer. He is here to make such a good pie. Is he wearing anything special? Like maybe a. Uh... Oh. Little chef hat. Of and he also course. has a little guy riding on his shoulder who oh. also has a little chef hat. Lovely. Uh, Sunny? Yeah. Me. Hi. Mm. I'm tempted. No. I'm no. Oh, <laughs> uh, stream doesn't know me. That's okay, Kiwi. They get to meet you now. Uh, I'm playing, <laughs> uh, Haven, who's an orange tiefling who I'm in love with. It's gonna be my new brand. I'm saying it here now. I don't Yay. care. Yay! This is the rebrand announcement stream. Welcome, everybody. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Today we're going to be showcasing all the new uh, Sunny. <laughs> I'm a life domain cleric. Uh, Whoa, yeah. really? Yeah. That's so crazy. All right, I, I haven't sorry. played a life domain cleric. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> a life domain this time. Ice, do you wanna? Do you wanna go next? See, see, bold of you to assume that I'm next. You are on the list. The bar. Okay, the all right. Bar. Okay. <laughs> okay, Panda. Welcome. Panda. All right. Hi, it's me, Panda. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm playing a big fucking Minotaur. Uh, that just is called Zero and just sometimes doesn't exist because it's quirky. So. That's true. Uh, they have like red fur and uh, their eyes are almost like you can't see through their eyes. They're like nothing. On a scale oh. from zero to the Lapori, where are they at? In what capacity? Boo-boo <laughs> 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 keys um, to crack rabbit scale. I guess scale. like, um, a Minotaur after Blapori. <laughs> 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 Lovely. Uh, alright, all right, that's the end of the list. No. <laughs> no? Uh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> hello, hi. <laughs> so, so I'm End Malcolm. Um, <laughs> yeah! Uh, Malcolm <laughs> is Nobody like understands though. So. Um, he's kind of clad in, like, kind of, like, rugged, tattered, like, black clothes. Kind of simple. Mm -hmm. Uh, his eyes, though, are a piercing golden yellow. Oh. God knows why. Piss. Mm. Freaking wonder. Uh, he also has a nice little ring <laughs> on his little finger. Huh? He's gay. Gold, gold gem. Oh. Uh, right in the middle. Well, he was gay. Oh. Well, he is still. the five of you stand <laughs> at the, the base. Character at the base of the tower uh the door is shut and no one has knocked on it yet and the five of you simply stand there anything you all want to say to each other Ty? no who's gonna reveal their character <laughs> voice first so, um, <laughs> who's gonna do it I, me because i don't have one um, um <laughs> it's a game of waiting I mean, yeah, I so i've never met I'm just people a do you want to introduce yourselves, maybe, in a slightly more in-depth uh, manner to the, for me only, of course, no one else is watching. Why did you say it like that? What? No Zombie, what are you doing? What? Why did you send me Oops. a link to join ID and DK? <laughs> I, I was right-clicking to check your volume. Oops. Ignore that. Ignore Oops. that. <laughs> ignore that. Um, so yes, who, are you gonna? Is anyone, any, anyone of you gonna introduce yourself to me or? Uh, Care This is my little guy. It's a hell little guy. Sorry. Every time you say it, I think you're saying talk. Care Bear. Care Broth. I mean, Care Broth probably seems like they must care, <laughs> considering the wee chef hat and the yeah. wee chef hat on his I boyfriend. very much care about the art of the craft of. Oh, wow. You know. Oh. I, I don't actually. I've never met you before. You know. 
<laughs> one, I don't, I've never met you before. You know. Oh, well, I don't, I've never met you before. Stop! It's baking, man. Oh, I see, I've met you now. I got the little chef out with a ton of them, you know? You know? Have you seen a yeah. chef before? Oh, yeah, I've seen a chef before. Um, do they, do they not wear the hats? I mean, sometimes they do something they don't. It's like a it's like a one to, like a one on one personal kind of basis. It's not like a set in stone rule. Yeah, well, obviously. Uh, I guess uh, for like higher ordinance kitchens, it's probably more standard practice for like, yeah. food safety. But for more for common safety. dwellings, it's not as actually as common to see the chef hats on every food uh, preparer. You know. Well, that sucks. You guys. Question. Uh, yeah, you know, not not every uh, not every uh, places uh, can afford uh, to keep upkeep such high standards of food safety, and therefore uh, afford the actual uh, chef hats for the chef. Uh-huh. Not everyone makes enough money to over prepare that much. You know, smaller towns on running on smaller, less stable economies can't always afford to have such luxuries as uh, high octane uh, food safety regulations. So it's just uh, hard. Yeah, but like, you know, it's what the hat represents, which is like a safety thing. But mm-hmm. also it's like, a, it's a symbol of status that you see um, yeah. among chefs as well. So I, yeah. clearly, by your chef's hat, you are a uh, excellent top tier chef. I have no reason to question your artisanal uh, Yeah, I think it's very good. Um, yeah. can, I, can I interject here with the question? No. Has anyone knocked <laughs> no, on the door? About, we are talking I'll about the chef hat. Please just, shut like, up. Started rapping on the door, like, can we... What are the lyrics? <laughs> what are the lyrics? <laughs> what are the, what are the yeah, you're rapping on the door. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> what, are the, what are the lyrics? You know? Let's shake my microphone. <laughs> Goes up to the door like you better lose yourself in the music the moment you own. You only get one sh- one shot. Oh, 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 oh. Um. One. This okay. 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 Once okay. In a so, what was the question? Uh, Augustine is knocking on the door, right? Yes. Yeah. Eminem style. As okay. are we not inside? Uh, no, you're all at <laughs> no. the door <laughs> of this place. Oh my god, um, we're all just outside the door. Yeah, you've all been talking about this. You've all been summoned oh. out here. Um, as yeah. Augustine, as soon time. as you knock on the door, a little imp opens the door to you, and he's very sh- he's. How tall is Augustine actually, Cedar? Um, tiny three man. foot five. Uh, the imp's a little <laughs> shorter than you, coming in at around two foot four. Uh, and he just kind of looks up at you and it's like, I don't know what you're all talking. Are you the five that got the summons? <laughs> yes. I really do hope so. Cause Great. I don't know if I can take it. Not sure what the whole chef know. that thing was about, but Mr. Oh, Tiny Let me Dares, tell you about No, chef no, you don't. No, I was listening. Don't. You don't you need, need to. You don't need to explain. Uh, please come in. Uh, go up the. He points to the back of the room where you notice that this entire room seems to just be dedicated. The entire base of the tower, all the way up to the cone at the top, seems to just be completely dedicated to stairs. The stairs continue oh, to God. just spiral up and up. It looks as if though they'll never end. I I'll uh, guide you up the stairs to Mr. Tynadaris's office, if you'd be so kind. Uh, and he he holds the door open and moves to the side to allow you all to walk inside. Okay. Yeah, we'll go. We're walking inside. We're making this mountain room. We all have this. Yep. Uh, yeah. the, the imp the imp begins to walk up the stairs, and I assume you all follow. As oh. and as he walks up the stairs, he. Uh, he kind of, the imp kind of prods a little bit more than he seems to be paid for. You know, he's asking you all, um, you know, I, 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 I hate to, I hate to ask, but like, you all have gone on an adventure before, right? Yeah. I think it's so funny. I've been on quite a few adventures. One I just nod. Many. <laughs> yes. I <laughs> definitely. You just, you just all seem like a lot of. It's it's a it's a mixed bunch here, you know. It's just it's just what I'm getting at. I mean, what does that even mean? I, I don't have know. Have you ever gone on an adventure? Well, no, but I have oh, steady. Em- I have go. steady employment, thank you. Oh, I, 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 get, I get paid a great amount to work for Mr. Tynadaris the Green. Thank you. Uh huh. Uh-huh. You pay him to work? No, no, he pays me. <laughs> What? Okay, cool. I Where thought I heard you, you wrong. What, what exactly is your job? 
I it's basic servitude really, but we get paid for it. Damn. Oh wow. I mean, it, I it's mean. It, we <clears throat> assist with experiments. We, uh, you know, we we're test subjects sometimes. It, it's it's a mixed <laughs> bag. <laughs> you know. Oh, oh oh look, we're we're almost at the top, and you see as he's indeed correct as you come across <laughs> the last curve, and you see a wooden throne it's not exactly a grand throne in a room it's called a chair zombie it, it no it's a very big wooden throne at the back wall it's a larger chair than the table and five chairs laid out in the middle of oh, the room oh so it's a big chair it's a big chair yes there's a big a, chair there's a large window <laughs> what at is the far... a throne but a big chair <laughs> There's a large exactly. There's a large window at the very edge of the room. The window you could have sworn you saw coming in. And at the back of the room, there's a large wall with a door behind it. And Tynodarus is this very old man. He's got this long white beard, the green wizard hat, you know, the typical one with the bended back and he's wearing these green robes and he's got both of his arms in his armrest. He goes, "Ah, great, great adventurous. T take a seat for me, would you?" I have a proposition. As you you read yeah, the letter, sure. I'm sure. I'm sure yeah. I'm a great proposition. I, I do. Yeah. It's it's involving a lot of money, a good time even, and oh. maybe a delicious baked good. We'll, we'll we'll get there when we get there. Please. I love delicious baked good. You lost it's my me favorite. Right Sorry about that. Uh, sorry, you know, sometimes things shriek in here. And don't mind it, you know. It's, wow. it's, it's old. Uh, it's experiment? mad. Why yeah, you? you know, we, we have a couple experiments go wrong it's every like now and again, and it leaves a shrieker in the wall. The imps will catch it wow. in a moment. And you see, you, you kind of okay. see uh, two imps over by the window, and you hear what sounds to be impish speak coming from the room with the, the door on it uh, at the very back end of the room. So you assume Tynodarus employs a lot of imps. Uh, do you all take a Are seat? Are they talking in a bistle? Uh, no, it just, it sounds like the same, the same gravelly little voice that the guy walking you up the stairs oh, is okay, talking to. It just sounds like a little freak. I'll sit down. While you yeah. sitting down? Yeah, first. Yeah. Yeah. As you all take a seat, Tynodarus raises up from his throne and walks to the very uh, tip of the table where all of you would be looking at his throne. And he states to you this, I, adventurers, I've summoned you here because frankly, well, firstly, after doing a bit of research, you all seemed a little desperate for work, so I had to help satiate that. Secondly... <laughs> I'm I've not been for work. I've been having a bit of a craving. You see, back where I used to live in my hometown, um, my grandma ran a lovely bakery. It made the best apple pie in the realm. It was, it was absolutely exquisite. I but. The problem is, with my age, firstly, my grandma died. That was awful, but that was about 50 years ago. Secondly, though, her bakery's been shut down for a long time as well, and I've forgotten the taste of her pie. I would set out to go raid the bakery myself for the recipe, but it seems as if, though, old age and my constant work schedule has disallowed me from going on such frivolous adventures. So, I've come to ask Why? you. Uh, firstly, uh, as to your payment, I'm willing to offer 1,500 gold pieces to split amongst the five of you for this job. <coughs> Secondly, I'm, I'm willing to offer you a copy of the recipe should you get the whole thing. Wait, yeah, somebody tell me the math on that first. That's 15 platinum. No, no, no like, so split between five, you know? You'd each get 15. three platinum. You'd, you'd each get three platinum if you, the, for, oh, okay. if we split it amongst <laughs> the five of yourself. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go. Look, I can't math that fast. Uh, now, I do warn you. Never said I, was gonna I warn you. haven't gone to the bakery myself in a while, so I'm not sure what awful things might be infesting it, but, again, that's why I'm paying you. Why is the bakery evil? I... I don't know. I Like I said, I haven't been there myself. Um, I... That's why I was hoping, you know, you all would go and take care of it for me. 
What do you say? I mean, yeah, that's what I am. Like, I Sounds good. Tira just stares into this guy's eyes, saying nothing, but just like the void in the eyes, just looking. Is, oh, okay. That guy's looking at him. Is that a is that a yes from the cow? Uh, I think it's probably a yes. Also, that's <laughs> it was a yes, but then that's... gets much angry of like eyes towards him. I think that's how you. Let's not that's just the... assume. I don't think you delineate the cow from that. Well, I... yeah, that's me. It's literally has horns. Literally walks on like two legs. I mean, apologize. I, I haven't it's seen. Hard. I well, I'm sorry. So I deeply apologize. I don't get out of my tower very often. As I said, there's lots of experiments that on go within these walls. Okay, that's great. Look into this so you don't make that mistake with somebody else. I, I also think I, that it's probably just healthy uh, to make sure you get out of the house a wee bit. That's like, true. Oxygen's good you know, for you. Oxygen oxygen is there, like I have a window right there. Yeah, but the sun is good for you too. And the grass is good. Take a little scroll. Do it you want the payment or not? Brain. Yeah. Okay, yeah. then please stop criticizing my life choices. <laughs> and, oh, silly me, I haven't even given you all a map. And he reaches into his robe pocket and unfurls a Wait map on the table. And I actually do have a picture of this oh my map. God. Let me find the map of Boston. <laughs> um, wow, those experiments. <laughs> uh, I actually do have a picture of this map, which I'll show on screen. Uh, now, I, it, lo it looks to be a long ways, but I've marked out an optimal path that should avoid any bandits sorry, or- Sorry, it looks like a fucking map from, like, backyard again. <laughs> that was- that was what I was going for. <laughs> um, yeah. It's about- it's about a two days trip from here. Uh, it shouldn't be a horrible, uh, trip. You can okay. take the map if that you so choose. great. I mean, yeah, I think that would be great. Right. Should we <laughs> go to the left forest? The top forest? <laughs> Or through the path in the no, middle. No, you go through the, the path, path in the middle. In the middle. <laughs> Zero trains there, right? <laughs> He's on Malcolm. Oh my god, it's a fucking Dora the Explorer path. Is, going what is you. Dora the Explorer? <laughs> the <laughs> middle, <laughs> the <laughs> middle, <laughs> middle <laughs> path? Correct. Boston. Wow, you really don't get out. There's no um, fox <laughs> that tries to steal our map while we go on this merry That'd be journey. real unfortunate. That would That'd be, be very, uh, very sad. I'd, I'd feel really bad that the guy went. Uh, uh, bro, does your little it. fella have a name? What? Oh. Your little, your little guy with the chef hat, does he have a name? Soup. <laughs> Can we call him Boots? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Who uh, is Boots? Boots what? Now. I don't get this anymore. I thought, you don't I, get out! You I thought this. I'd be hiring a sa- either. Can you please just get the pie? It's the, the recipe. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get, we're still gonna get the pie. All right, thank you. Uh, I need, no, no, there's no pie in that bakery. It's been shut down for years. I need the we're recipe. We're gonna get the pie recipe. Um, oh, oh, <laughs> yeah, right. I'm being... Bro really needs Uber Eats. Oh, literally. <laughs> I don't know what that is, and I'm not gonna keep asking. Ye old eatery. <laughs> I. Please. I'm gonna force that. You know how out here? Please, he he just kind of points to the stairs. Please, please go. You're frightening me in this. You've he's, he's never ordered out. food from Deliveragon? I don't. All right. Yes. I, I we're going. Food. We're going. We're going. Let's All go. Right. Uh, the imp doesn't. Do the imp doesn't follow you down the tower, but it does. You know, kind of hold its arm out to guide the way to leave the tower. Um, oh, you the way we already know. You see, uh, as you exit the tower, the you fire. see awaiting you just outside is a cart and horses. Two horses, to be exact. It does have horses. Yeah. This wasn't, uh, horses. This wasn't out there previously, but it has mysteriously appeared now, and Describe no one the seems horses, to own it. zombie. Uh, the horses yeah. are beautiful, snow white in color. Their manes are a darker, more grayer shade as it kind of <laughs> comes back on their heads, and they have these nice silver eyes about them. A lot of white going on and gray as well. What are their names? Oh, they have names. Uh, their names are Sugar and Spice. <laughs> yeah. It fits with the pie thing. Wait a minute. <laughs> Is there like a bonus nice. mission to find everything nice? The third <laughs> missing horse? The pie, of no, course. No, no, the cart's name is everything nice. It's the everything nice cart. Bro, run by they Sugar turned and the Spice. third horse into a cart. That's so <laughs> Why would they do that? It's made Can't of believe that. You all, are you all getting in the cart and using it? Yes. Yeah. 
doing the horse little pet pet. Oh, okay. Nice. I'm putting my little guy on it too. All right. Well, Go give me a moment bread. for the music to kick in because uh, that. Okay, I'm getting an old spice ad with a unicorn on it. I think I found where wow. everything wow. nice spice. went. <laughs> spice. It went, it's spice. Old, yeah, spice got a job. Nice. Um. Anyhow, <laughs> as yeah, as you all strike the reins and start on your journey, the first day is. Hey, what kind of cart is this? Uh, it's a it's a pretty basic cart. It's comfortable. It's not like pioneer tier uh, uncomfortable. You know, it works for you. It's comfortable. You can sleep in it. Well, and what's yeah? But are we talking you know? like a wooden thing? Are we talking like a trail of organ? That what kind of thing are we talking? What do you not mean? trail of organ? <laughs> I, yeah, don't, I don't. Think it's so, not but... called Trail to Oregon. It's called the Oregon Trail. The Oregon Trail. I don't fucking care. It's comfortable. It's a pioneer cart. It's it's, 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 it's nice pioneer cart. cart and design. It's got the little uh, cloth over <laughs> arch, but inside is are pillows. You know, some food for you on the trip. And the first they used day. Used to ride these babies for miles. <laughs> the first yeah. day goes relatively normally. You know, it, it's a two-day yes. trip, and a after the first day. You know, night passes by. You see the trees that were marked on the map, the forests. You swear that the closer you get to the bakery, the more and more trees you see with bright red apples hanging from them, all of the same shade of red. And as the second day dawns, you kind of get to a more rocky area in the in in the land. You know, the cart kind of bumps for a moment. Um. Now, well, are you all, are you all saying anything before I ask you anything? Are you all saying anything to each other? Um, I feel like Augustine is just like noticing all the red apples. Like that that's not a that's not normal. What is normal? Is it not normal? Well, considering how many of them are grown and they're perfectly ripe, you know that's not the most normal. I mean, maybe thing we just seen. have good timing and they haven't been picked yet. Uh, they in season? Like, you don't know. I don't know. Do you know? You're the one with the chef hat. Hey, hey, I make I make the food. I don't I don't pick it. So um But you gotta know details about them. No. Like you what? you don't you have to know what's in season to know what you're making around that time? I get instructions. I st oh, you, were saying, okay. you were saying something. Sorry, I I'm just wondering, do we um like what like what does everyone do? What's everyone's skill sets exactly? Um Rogue. Healing. Is this an in character question or Yeah, this is an in character yeah. question. <laughs> oh uh, Zero uh, um <laughs> has been for the entire time just like arms crossed, like eyes closed, but like tapping their leg up and down. Um Who's driving. They op they open their huh? Who's driving? I just thought about that. I am. Okay. The horses. <laughs> so I'll be dumb. the driver. Uh, Augustine is that. <laughs> Zero just kind of like looks, like opens an eye at you. Uh, quite actually grabs almost the air, like as if it was like a piece of cloth, rips it up slightly, making a tear in the fabric of reality, pulls oh. out a fucking sword, shows it, and then puts it back in. It's a very like regal looking sword that's like pitch black. Well, that's not terrifying. Heck so yeah! I just closed my eyes again. Awesome. Sorry. I got jumps get the muffins on the move. Oh. <laughs> you know, um, you know, I like my normal rapier, and you know, Augustine just kind of like pulls out like this old like silver, the silver rapier, just kind of like unsheaths it. It's a little ornated with like a couple of rubies on it, but nothing like crazy out of it. I like my uh, my old fashions, but you know, you you do you. I see. I see. Um, but uh, you're the other two, huh? What, what exactly do you do? Oh, there's the what? Oh. Well, the you and the the tiefling. Yeah, I got my little guy. <laughs> okay. Is that I... it? Just you have the little guy? Yeah, my little guy. Do you fight for you or? I don't know. What do you, you fight you don't... with? Yeah, I, I got a, I got a sword. It's just a sword. You know, I'll take it. Go I so wouldn't have been surprised if you pulled out the frying pan, so I'll take a sword. There you go. Um 
What about you, last one? With the, um, you know... I mean, I've got a mace, but I'd rather just use magic. Well, that's a, the most clear answer I've had so far. Yes. <laughs> and I'm like, look, guess... look, at, look at him, he's on the horse. Because it's only fair I share, you know me, I'm also like yeah. your spellcasting type. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um, my power comes from uh, a friend of mine. You know, it's not, it's not totally mine. It's, uh, that great. You know, friendship is always a great thing. Well, it well, didn't actually uh, arise from a friendship per se. It's I needed Wait, someone. Was it something more? It something less. <laughs> you know, yeah, listen. Don't worry. You don't well have to lie to us. We're it, all it here. Well, it involved someone who's something more, but uh, he was gone. Is Malcolm gay for Mephistopheles? <laughs> No, no. <laughs> no, he has. That's a, well, that's August I, had, had. I had. That was not. That was not Zero, by the way. Zero still quite quiet. That um, was me. Are you still <laughs> saying in character that you're talking about how you had a boyfriend? Yeah. So I had this boyfriend. Uh, he lost love of my life. Lost him to tragic accident. Um. So I sought out help to try bring him back. And while, uh, the patron I found did in fact bring him back he wasn't the same healus that i lost um and he didn't see me the way he used to so Aww. he oh, walk different paths <laughs> oh, bummer. So that's it. i mean no uh, bros right it, it was a cow bummer um <laughs> Yeah, that moment. That's how I would put it. So you know, now I'm just doing odd jobs, trying to make something of myself. Maybe That's make nice. something he can be proud of. We'll see. Yeah. All of the Good rest of you. us. I have Good this weapon. No, this so weapon. here's my whole oh, life story. Have full... well, there's a lot I more to. I might have a weapon. There's a lot. There's a lot more to zero. You have a weapon? Um. Oh yeah, I have a club. <laughs> it's funny, actually. It reminds me. Um, there's some clubs I'm not allowed in anymore. Oh. Yeah? Like what? Well, that sounds great. Anyway, uh... <laughs> no, I want to know what these clubs are. No, 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 no. Let I want to know speak. what these Let clubs are. Well, you see, I have this great club, which is actually the name of another club I'm not allowed <laughs> uh -huh. in anymore. Uh-huh. Which, to be fair, it's a misleading name. It wasn't that great. I didn't think so. Um, okay, look, what other some clubs? Uh, well, <laughs> n well, you know, some people get a bit rowdy on a night and think, wouldn't it be funny if I punch someone? They forget I'm made out of stone, and then uh, they they just don't have enough to back up the first punch. So then that's... I get kicked out because that's my fault, apparently. Self defense. Oh and no, they You'd deserve to get kicked make out, not you. Boston. Oh, it's fine. I get put outside. I put them in the. Where's game. Boston? Boston. Yeah, you'll find it one day. Okay. The, the great Boston in the sky. The great Boston. <laughs> By the bing, you're going to heaven. Oh my god, no, it's Boston in Brazil. <laughs> Boston's this little place up on up in the corners. It's where I ran my smuggling business for a time before I uh this and you kinda of like points to like the entire like missing part of his face oh god you lose that yeah what's the story there uh well you you learn some you lose some <laughs> what does that mean <laughs> i'm guessing you lost that one then <laughs> you lose you learn something but you lose something to learn it okay what did you learn yeah for sure what the fuck <laughs> what did you what Listen, did you learn i can have what my did you own learn? lessons what did you what did you learn uh, don't mess with the little guy. Don't mess with the little guy. Don't say you are the little guy. The little guy. Yeah, don't mess with the little guy. There was like there was these like four four or five pixies that I had to go. Uh, I had to get a smuggle group from. I had to get like a couple pounds of the yeah. magic items. He's a deal. <laughs> oh no, okay. no, he's not that kind. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> the pause said it. Oh. It was no. It was the pause and the inhale from the nose. Like, yeah. I didn't mean to at all. That was a pure instinct. From the... I was like, oh. <laughs> it's just like yeah, the you know the pixie dust, you know. <laughs> that yeah, sure. Dust. We'll go with that. It's not what it was, but we'll go with that. <laughs> um, 
Damn. Wow, they tried to stiff me, so uh, what? I tried to <laughs> stiff, you know, like stiff you, like stiff you from cash. Stiff me, so not give me the money. So I had to, uh, I had to brunt a little bit to get my part of the cash. Yeah. So you got cash, you lost face. Pretty much, but uh, I can clean it up. It's all right. And um, okay. So Tommy, tell me what. Tell me what's in front of me first. Ah, right. Okay. Do. So now, we, now, okay. So both, so Zero and Augustine weren't exactly too too involved in the conversation, at least initially when I sent those DMs. Uh, Cedar, you, you, and Zero, Zero, when you open your eyes, of course, periodically, yeah, I imagine. I just want to say to everyone, I got a nat twenty uh -huh. uh, for a seventeen yeah, on from, my perception check. Seventeen. I got a dirty twenty. Nice minus. <laughs> three to wisdom loser. Mining three buster. Anyway, so in front of you, before you, Cedar, you see a kind of almost blockade made of goblins. Uh, the rocks around the the road, you know, kind of these boulders have kind of been pushed together to sort of make a blockade in the path. And three goblins are just kind of sitting on it, kicking their feet. The goblins are, you know, the, your typical green little green men with uh you know the pointy ears they're wearing they are wearing you know rather nice clothes and something you notice about the three of them is that while two of them are wearing you know these raggedy leather shirts and loincloth one of them is wearing a baker's apron that is far <laughs> too large for them all right uh you're this about is the part of the <laughs> you're about 20 feet from these goblins and they have not seen you yet uh <laughs> this is the part where i'd be quick about what i'm about to do um, I'm gonna quickly cast the sky self to sort of fix up the face, oh. make it a lot more pristine, mm -hmm. like a normal like deep gnome face. And then I'm also gonna use uh, uh, Argusine has like this little backpack next to him. He's gonna just like quickly tug off like the good clothes and just put on like these more raggedy like brown leather Ooh. clothing okay. using his disguise smart. kit. Oh, I see. Changing up. There. And then he puts away his he puts away his rapier and then pu like pulls out this like rusty copper one. Yeah, you you, you also see uh, zero. It's now stand up, quite large and like it almost tips over the thing, and just pulls out this large sword once again. This rapier. Okay, oh. hey, let's sit back down. I don't want to pop the card as well as pop my own eyeballs. <laughs> I'm zero is just like looking directly where the goblins are. We don't need to do violence just yet. Just keep it down. I can calm it. I don't know what's going on. I just give a little nod what? to to be like, okay. I mean, I'd assume at this point we'd have followed fucking Zero's gaze. Yeah, or... you. Uh, everyone can now see these three goblins. You know, two of them are kind of kicking their feet as they're watching the uh, much uh, it, the the middle one wearing the aprons a little bigger. And Augustine and Zero, you can kind of assume this one is older than the other two simply by height. But he seems to be, you know, talking to the two of them again. They have not seen you yet. All right, so. I think that's everything I need to do to, to uh, get myself prepared. If there's anything yeah. else anybody needs to do, um, like you see, um, Zero like touch their chest and kind of like s almost seem to start to flicker slightly out of um, reality, but still there. And this is just how I'm using Armor of Shadows to cast Mage on by myself. But that's not all freaky right. at all. Anyway, let's just get on the road here. Let's make sure nothing bad happens. So okay, Augustine, are you stopping the cart and then hopping out, or uh, yeah, I'll else? stop the cart and I'll hop out. All right. <laughs> what are you doing? Because there's the here? other. Uh, can I walk up to these goblins? Have they noticed that I've stopped the cart in front of them? Uh, how far away did you stop the cart from? You were about twenty like, feet from them previously. Uh, I want to say ten feet. Uh, they've kind of seen the cart at this point, but they aren't paying it any mind since you've stopped. You know, they're just kind of still listening to the bigger goblin with the apron on gentlemen gentlemen I, what are we doing here um our job and that would be uh what w well no one's allowed near the bakery because it's our territory i see i see yeah well that's good okay. i'm glad your eyes work <laughs> sorry <laughs> I, I mean, that's really great for you, but, ones for the top. but listen, okay. uh, listen, me and my brothers here, you know, we, we gotta, we gotta keep anybody from going in, going out, you know how it is. Uh, there's an alternate way, if you're going up to Kendall, Kendall Keep, uh, through the forest up there, that's a good way to do it. Alright, uh, let's, let's think about this. Think about what?
I I could have done something that would have been so much smarter. That would have been that would have been smart. Funny they didn't look at crazy. Uh well, let me think of it this way. You can see that uh Augustine's kind of changed his pattern of tonage. He's now moving into like more of a like what you would call a, a more dense and like deep tone using Master of Intrigue. Are you pretending to sound dumber? Uh, no. I'm I'm pretending to sound more intimidating. Okay. Listen, I'm not a... I'm not a poser, for what you call it. What? Me and my buds in the cot. We got a... We got something. Like... What? Something that if you don't let me through... Well, uh... Let's just say that you won't be seeing any more family for a few days. Roll me or intimidation on that. Life. Roll me on. Uh, can I give the help action by standing up in the cart, menacing and look at them with a fucking sword? <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> My eyes aren't real. <laughs> yes, that's perfect. That is a nineteen. Uh, you see the goblet. The goblins look at you for a moment. You're this little, this little guy. You know, there's just like the the two shorter ones are like slightly shorter than the taller one. The taller one's near your height, but as the taller one kind of like looks at you a little confused, almost like this little guy's gonna kill me. It looks up and sees Zero just standing there, death staring him with eyes that don't seem to end, and he's just like. I'll take that as a yes. Thank you. I, Thank uh, you. We, 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 I, um, he just kind of keeps stammering. He he doesn't he doesn't exactly say yes or no to anything you say. Augustine's just gonna turn like his back and just start walking, right back to the car. No, you can't. You can't go 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 through through here. That's not good. And he just he stops as soon as he hears no. And he just kind of like does that heel click turnaround. Mm. All right, I'm gonna give you one more shot. You can either uh. never see your family, never see friends, get girlfriend. I don't think you know how you goblin society works. Society. I wasn't gonna correct you on earlier. We don't like do that, but I get your well, point. Uh, sucks to be you, doesn't it? No. It's well, it makes nice. my job easier. We get any pie we want, you know. I mean, it makes my job a little easier. You see, you see, the two little goblins are kind of like tugging on his apron, like, C "Come on, it's it's not worth it. It's not worth it." Uh, uh yeah, you can, uh, you could go through, and you see his eyes light up for a moment. But we're not pushing the rocks back, <laughs> fellas. Let's go. And he motions to take his two little brothers and they jump over the rocks and run all the way back up the road past where the rocks are. Do you do anything to try to stop them as they do or? Um, do I want to be, do I want to be mean? No, I, no, I won't do anything. All right. Is any uh, zero? Do you want to do anything since you can see them running off? If anybody else also wants to say they saw them, feel free. No, I'm balling. We're all. I'm just gonna watch them go and then look back at Augustine. Well, I guess we're having to lift rocks. What is Malcolm doing? Ooh. I'm also thinking about the last time I was in a zombie D and D session and. Uh, supposed foes were walking away from us, and they had the capacity to Eldritch Blast them as they were walking oh, away. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> I do have a, I do have a, what's it called? I do have a, I'm sure if I really wanted to, but yeah, <gasps> we could absolutely kill them. We could absolutely. Don't know if one of those Sullivan situations. Not really. About? We don't really need to. What you guys thinking about? <laughs> oh, you know. <laughs> Nothing. I just like to point my sword towards the goblins and like tip it side to side as in like yes, no, yes, no. No. To Augustine or to uh, No. To I'm like pointing my sword towards the goblins and kind of like going up and down. Oh, oh I think we're going with no. <laughs> no. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Running, running away. Be fine. I, just, I fucking throw my sword and it just disappears into nothingness. Oh, sure. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess we're doing cool. it. Sorry, bud. <laughs> I right, turn to we... Cape and I just kind of like nod and then like look back to what I was doing. <laughs> can we uh can we get rid of the rocks? Yeah, okay. we're doing this. Um, I don't know. I can lift If you're just lifting rocks, if you're looking at the rocks, the rocks are fairly. Uh, the rocks are large. They're clearly natural, but they've all been kind of pushed together in such a way <laughs> that going over them, they're jagged and they'd likely damage your cart's wheels. It might take you longer to get there, which gives them more time to prepare for you coming. Uh, but you could easily maybe destroy them with a spell. You could, you, you could destroy <laughs> the rocks if you wanted to, or you could move them. But it's your choice. Um, I'll leave that to the spellcasters. Augustine's gonna like hands up, back away, like, do what you need to do, boys. I'm gonna kick a rock. <laughs> kick one. Well, that's what I did. Um, How big are the rocks? You, uh... Uh, each of the rocks are about uh, five feet by five feet. You know, some of they vary Ooh. in size by a couple feet each. Some of them are even buried a little ways into the ground, but the ones that are kind of up above the ground oh, are about geez. five feet by five feet. <laughs> Interesting. And what's the deal with rocks there? Oh, no. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> These are no, no, just messaged me. Don't worry. <laughs> These things are gonna move. I mean, like, I mean, I'm sure one of you have something. You can just break them, right? You could if you yeah. really wanted to. It might take us some time, but I don't really have the uh, equipment. Sorry, here. I need to share it. Nairo fucking bought me a ticket for hide. Oh, <laughs> oh! yo. Nice. So crunchy. Um, I mean, what if I just threw Eldritch Blast at things? Yeah, that's the last. That's you last do day. you. Use, do you. Well, you see, due to my uh, wonderful array of. What are they called? Eldritch Invocations. Not only do I have Agonizing Blast, I have Repelling Blast. Oh, you oh. have full fucking Eldritch Blast, goddamn. So any rock that you get that. fucking bounced 10 feet away. All right. Oh, yeah, I gotta go. You wanna, you wanna do that? Yeah, I'm taking a shot, So you're shooting an Eldritch Blast at the rocks, correct? Yeah. Um. Oh. Oh, were you saying something? I mean, I mean, do I? I mean, I'm rolling to hit, right? Uh, yeah, go <laughs> ahead. All right, cool. Nat twenty. Well, okay. I was gonna say I consider it more of a luck roll since they're unmoving objects. But as you kind of prepare an eldritch blast in your hand, you send forward the beam of energy, and it hits directly in the middle of this rock barrier. And due to your repelling blast, at, what does agonizing do? You add your damage to uh, it. Add charisma to it, yeah. Okay. Uh, you pulverize the one you hit, but the rest of the rocks all kind of fly backward uh, a little bit. Not super duper far away, but they blow away just enough so that you've cleared a path through the rocks and forward. Well, let's get back on the road again. Good job, bud. Zero just goes back down, and it, like, tips the cart slightly. Here. Augustine's just going to get back onto the cart at the helm and just... You know, quack the whip and the be on their way through the the reins, the whip, the reins. Yeah. Um, heading through the rocks. It's your second day on the road, and after about another full day goes by, you know, the trees with apples become less sparse and become more concentrated as you get closer to the bakery. However, the grass near the bakery, you notice as you get closer, uh, seems to die out it seems to be more brown nasty and just plain dead but as you get close to the bakery you notice that there's a large set of apple trees and now that you've taken another rest you know you've all rested up uh anything you all want to say to each other as you approach the bakery aka let me get the map up yeah for sure well so excited for this Oh, I want to make that freaking pie, maybe. We do see that Zero has, like, slowly shuffled a bit closer to Haven. Not very oh. close, but just, like, a tiny bit closer. I'd recommend everybody get their apples in a row here. Is that what? a pun? Gotta, like, what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> it's a pun. <laughs> I know, I'm just gonna... <laughs> We're punning here. 
You know how you say like you get everything their ducks in a row? Yeah. I like ducks. Sorry. That's nice. Ducks are cool, I think. I think I got it. Just get yourself. Just get yourselves put together. I'm fine. I'm good. I'm also doing good. It's crazy. I'm an apple. Wow. Um, Let me get me an apple from the tree up there. As you all pull up. You know, uh, to the bakery. You notice that there seems to be kind of marks in the grass where houses might used to have been, places, shops, but they're all gone now. All that's left is this large bakery building. And as you approach the bakery, something I forgot to mark on the map is a large tree, uncharacteristic to this area, as most of the trees seem to be in an apple orchard just behind the uh, bakery. But this large tree is sitting in front of the shop, not blocking the door directly, but near the front of the shop. And this door, or not door, this tree is, you know, also strange to you all as it's not an apple tree but you all have parked your cart where it is on the map anywhere you'd like to go first like you like any hell no i'm joking um let me see where that said cards are going hmm? oh i should probably post i have to them. load up to post the map too mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, I also, can see it in case my internet will lag out. Also to mention um, that as you approach the side of the bakery, you see large painted on letters that have kind of chipped away oh, uh... with time. But you see Grammy's Bakery plastered on the side. On the very, you see the large outcrop right there of that one room. It's plastered on that part of the uh, bakery. Oh, wow, well, look at that. That's cute. What? I wonder if we this place with them. <laughs> I am... They did apple crimes. Yeah, I mean, they might have, crimes you never against know. against apples. Yeah, apple could, crimes you know. involving apples. Have you guys ever done an apple crime? Have you? Been out of? Zero shakes I had. Yeah, that's what I, I thought. I have no idea what you're saying to me. Good have people. you? No. Good. I've, I've yeah, witnessed just... apple crimes. Well, I was almost an accessory to one, but I. Oh. Wow. <laughs> I never told you how Helis died the first time. Oh. From an apple, apple crime? Oh no, it's unrelated. I just miss him. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's fine. Uh -huh. That's great. <laughs> I miss my wife, Kels. I, I miss her. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I miss my wife, broth. I mean, my husband's broth. I mean, he's kind of a wife. My wife. Yeah. Like, okay. That's it. Yeah. Uh, I'm we're not gonna touch that one. It's not weird. Anything, you guys are weird. Anything oh, we wanna do. It's not weird in that term. Um, oh yeah. Is there all get up? And, um, I was gonna say look for something. I'm like mm, minus three perception. Absolutely not. Um, <laughs> what are the, what are the apples like? Why do the, I, I, what, I don't know that one tree. What's the one tree? That one tree. You know the one tree that doesn't that have any tree. apples. What's that like? Yeah, that one tree without apples. Yeah. Yeah. Is that yeah, where you're going? That's probably lonely. Are you Actually, all yeah, investigating that? That's a lonely tree. That's Zero's where Bravo's going, going like, guys. Zero's going to like wait until everyone's looking at that tree, and then uh, Zero just disappears into nothingness. I'm casting invisibility on myself. Oh, lovely. <laughs> I'm preparing. Well, that's, uh, that's good for the whole family. But he's going to say a part of the group just is going to be invisible. It's a very it's funny lonely tree. When you think about it, because we technically lost nothing. Because <laughs> they're, they're zero. Oh, and she's so funny, and I can't even talk about apples. That's a, that's a good one. <laughs> well, you gotta right, let's take to a laugh here. at the little things. At when this the lonely things tree. Are, uh, the little victories. Yep. Yeah. Are we. <laughs> do I always learn about big victories. Okay. Uh, where I came from. Are you Stop. all? <laughs> I don't are... believe in little victories. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. Are you all looking at the tree out front of the entrance? Yeah. 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 Um. All right. Everybody, as you look at it, make a perception check. Oh okay. boy. Okay. 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 Nice okay. minus three, loser. Sorry. Oh, uh, that's a five. Five. Well, what check? I just. I just totally did actually. Listen to you. What check? Perception. <laughs> so panda, that's you got a five. Yeah. Oh. Fucking, let's go. Uh, 25. 
I have bad perception because there's nothing in my eyes, obviously. Wow. Augustine's got a 23. 23 Augustine. 22. Dope as fuck. That's a 7, babe. 2. You got a 2? It's like a 22, just 20 less. Okay. That's pretty similar. Okay. Broth. Oh, uh, six. I'm getting distracted looking at my little guy. Um, Where'd so, go? so like Broth, me. Malcolm, and Zero, as you look at it, it's a tree. It's uh, a tree. but Augustine and Haven, as you look at this, hey, you can make out, you can make out on, like, the, the bark of the tree, closed eyes, and, uh, kind of a oh, mouth, like a, like a snore you can hear in the mouth, uh, oh, kind so of, easy. kind of, uh, bu bu what, what is the word, bob, like, the lips kind of vibrate, I don't know how to describe that motion when you make it, when you snore, but the tree, what you notice is the tree has closed eyes and it's snoring very quietly. It's a sleepy tree. I, that, that might be his, that might be his grandma. As, <laughs> wait, what? Oh. <laughs> Hello, good morning. Uh, what, hey, <laughs> hey, hey, what? Uh, the tree Hello. awakens, and to everyone who didn't, who thought it was a tree, you're very surprised when the tree starts <laughs> speaking to you. Um, the tree opens its eyes, and it's got these, uh, it almost, these eyes are wooden, but Dude. you can make out the pupils on them, and the mouth begins to move as it speaks to you. Uh, uh, you kids, what are you doing outside the, the, this, this bakery? It's we closed. Can't even get over the age it's of closed 50. for visitors. We well, we a recipe. well, it's Talks. been closed for years. I'm sure there's not even so a we go recipe. Into well, listen, I don't, I don't know. I went to sleep. I, I used to How long have you been sleeping for? I've been sleeping for quite a while, thank you, because those stupid <laughs> goblins went and raided the whole thing after Grammy died. Rude. Mm. Recipe. Everybody called her that. I don't know why. I'm older than her. She was lovely, though. I, I will say she was like the grandma I never had because treants don't have grandmas. We have. Did you like her? She was nice. <laughs> I quite enjoyed her company. Um. Mm. Are. I think you like her. Okay, I think are you, you like her? Recipe? You just called her like a grandma. That is a little strange that you think that. Yeah, that's but a little look, odd, you know. Like, look, I have kid, my you you kids can't be sneaking in here. There's goblins everywhere. The apple. Well, we're gonna do it anyway. What you shouldn't. You oh, no, kids are just you're going to get you're going to get, you're going going to get yourself the killed. Your recipe. You're going to get yourself killed if you go in yeah, there. Fuck it. Let's get going. No! Wait, no! So what did you say about the apple orchard? Uh, Augustine, are you just trying to walk in? I'll say what I was going to say in a moment. He'll start walking towards the door, yeah. Uh, you see as from the leaves of the tree, a large arm kind of comes down and puts like a blockade in front of you. It's not safe for you to go in there. I, I, I'm supposed to be making sure no one goes in there. I'm surprised you even got here in the first place. <laughs> hey, what did you say about the orchard? Orchard has been infested by a couple of dryads who decided to take up refuge in there. <sighs> oh boy, dryads! Let's oh. hope Flex isn't hit. He uh, he he kind of oh, cry. He kind of brings down another wooden arm from the tree and crosses it around his trunk. You kids can't be sneaking. You youngsters all coming here with the promise. And China Darius sent you. I'm like what? like Did over the age of seventy. I don't care. I'm would, old. Would I be... we help you and then you'll let us do something? I don't need any help. I just don't want you young uns going in there. Can I be a little bit like silly? And while invisible, go around the leaf and try and go in. Uh, go Basically in. go around the arm and then just like go inside. Kind of where Augustine was going. Uh, so you're trying to go to the door? Yeah. Uh, okay. As you make it to the door and reach for for the, uh, the knob, as you kind of, like, wiggle it to try to open it, you hear what sounds to be distinctly on the other end, the kind of bang, bang, bang of something hitting the door, stopping you from going in. It seems as if it's boarded up from the inside. Am I able to, like, open it at all to be able to look inside? 
Uh, you can crack it open very slightly, but I'd say roll perception to see if you can make out anything inside as it's dark and unlit. Four. It's a dark room. <laughs> hmm. Do I? How how good's my history? The dark the zero. room. Do you remember this? The document? question of the century. No. Can Augustine see this happening? Like, the door just creaking uh, open and banging you're, it? You're, like, slightly taller than his hand. Not by much, but you're still slightly taller than the hand. So you could peek over and see the door just, like, kind of creaking open a little bit, but no one opening it. Zombie, Can if I, I got in, would it secrets break this one shot? Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> <I love laughs> secrets breaking. I love that you have you ask that um because uh, <laughs> um, uh as a bonus uh, action, you can teleport a distance up to your movement speed to an empty space that you can see all that you know is there and you can fit in so can i try and go 15 <laughs> feet inside you all. if it's empty uh sure i'd have to roll a 15 history check to remember the location but i will oh. say i will say that um i will have to cut back to uh everybody else yeah but sure you can go ahead and try all right <laughs> i got an 18 uh you could definitely teleport yeah, you know. in there with your ability yeah amazing i just appear in so when the, the people just kind of see like a, a in reality and then it comes back out good or like then it like folds back out kind of thing before before um zero like fully left and like closed the door fully could augustine like see through it and like try to peek in uh not enough to really make anything out no you're again peeking over his hand so i would say no not from so like, the, the angle still behind the, the angle just doesn't work i listen you, did Tyna Darius send yeah. you, you kids, you stupid kids? You don't have to be mean about it. Well, listen, I just, gonna make I, had, guy I just don't want the goblins to have free dinner. I said good morning to you and everything. I just don't want those goblins to have a free dinner. So you know what? I'm going to give you a bit of advice. Yeah. The goblins like to use the back entrance by the loading docks, but they have a hard time getting in through there. So, uh -huh. if you're looking to sneak in, you could simply go in through the loading dock and get inside. Uh, there's a foul smell coming from back there, though, so uh -huh. I'd be a little careful. The dryads might That's also... That's great, I don't have a nose. The dryads might also know something, but I don't ever go back there anymore. They're pesky teenagers, and they throw apples at me sometimes, even though they taste That's gross. so mean of them. I know! So and they're Macintosh, and my name is Mac. Oh, I, they're, they're gross. I hate so Macintosh cruel. apples. Oh, what kind of apple do you like? I like the... <laughs> Granny Smith, those are always good ones. They aren't the ones oh, yeah. that Granny used yeah, to use in her pies, yeah, but yeah, Granny could make old. Macintosh apples taste delicious. Mm. You, know, you know that for she use? Okay. I, it's been years, young one. But I wouldn't recommend That's going in. To be. I wouldn't recommend Me going in through the front entrance. Just go around. <laughs> <Exactly>. Yeah. <laughs> I would recommend. Give me just a moment, real quick. Recipe. Um, so, as you all are talking to Mac and as he's giving you this info, uh, Zero, you are inside, and hold on, let me let me find the thingamabob. Let me find the wait. I need to find the right inside area. Okay, here we go. The hold thingamabob. On. Uh, as you get inside, Zero, and teleport in. There's a door missing on this map, but that's okay. Imagine there's a door at the on the left side. Um, you kind of, you're you're in a place with several shelves on it, and a warforge is standing behind the counter. And as soon as it, as soon as you kind of land inside, all these light cantrips on the ceiling all just pop, 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 begin to turn on and light up the room as this warforged kind of sparks and churns a little and turns on and gives you what sounds to be almost a pre-recorded message. Well, hey, the, the, the air, we are currently closed for business. It seems to spark and, uh, like, you know, kind of jitter a bit, but this sound does seem to attract the attention of something as you hear from the door behind it uh, two sets of voices going, 
You can't make out their words, though. Am I able to try... Like, what is blocking the door? Uh, the Warforged. The one... Those in the one that I just came through, kind of, doing. Oh, the... Oh, the door you came through. What, no. Yeah. What, the Warforged... The, door? the war... The, to clarify what it's saying, the Warforged, yeah. marked by C for clerk, is behind a counter blocking the door that you're mm -hmm. hearing the voices come out of. However, the actual door is blocked by uh, a couple wooden planks kind of slapped on there, and as you kind of look closer, it seems failed pies are kind of just mushed together to glue them onto the door, so you could pull them off. Yeah, Cedar I will... Going through. I will fucking take them all off. Uh, alright, roll me a strength check, then. Or oh boy. athletics check. Oh boy. Um, 15. Uh, hold on, let me check. I have to check the book. I'm very loosely going up this book. That's just one over. You see this rotting high glued together wood on the door and you walk over to it uh, the door is also missing on this map but shh uh and <laughs> you grab onto the the boards and you with a with a gross squelching <laughs> you break off the boards uh this immediately causes the doors to swing open everybody outside you can now see just nothing break these boards on the door and swing open mac just mac just immediately goes what 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 sorcery is th what are you doing zero just like walk out the door and kind of round the corner just like while invisible just kind of like tiny bit shaking but no one can see it what what is this you all are That's, uh... doing i i don't what? You, recipe the door broke what I, I didn't told do you that. The yeah, we've been dog. here this whole time in front of you. We've There's only four of us. at you this entire time. You interrupt yeah. me from my nap to ignore my advice. I said I'm good morning. I'm still standing. I, I I'm you going. just wanted to be away. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm going back to bed. You all are so Okay. Good the, good arms, the arms retract and go up back into the leaves of the tree. The door to the shop now lays open in front of you. And Zero, you're standing in there. Well, I've gone oh. a tiny bit out of the door. Oh, I so you've, wa you've walked back outside with them. Yeah. Okay. I like kind of... Well, uh, I'll go, go, oh, that's go perfect. Back. Yeah, I'll go back to the group. I'm like, I'm like, Zero is kind of shaking, but no one can see it. Invisibility, but... Good job, cool person. Let's see. Uh, I don't even know. Where he's trying to stand uh, basically as close to uh, Haven without them noticing as possible. <laughs> Fantastic job, everyone. Let's uh, let's bust out. Let's get our ways let's in. Go. Here, yeah. Uh, so you're all walking into the shop. Yeah. 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 Uh, as you all walk in, uh, you. You all walk inside, and I'm gonna I'm gonna just use Z oh, for okay. all of you at the moment. Uh, as you all walk wow. inside, you hear these voices in the door, kind of girl like, uh, They seem to be getting louder and louder as the clerk continues to go. Well, well, well uh, um, we are currently closed oh. for business, and it just keeps like waving its arm in a robotic motion that jitters every now and again. You can see the wooden strings keeping it together. It's a very shoddily maged warforged manning the counter. If any of you are to look on the shelves, you'll notice various <laughs> junk seemingly put here by the goblins that occupy this place. Not much is really on the shelves of use that you can see at least right now. Uh, but yeah, what do we want to do? On recipe. Can I try to shut the Warforged off? Can I like try to like open it up and like turn it off fully? You want to kill him at? Uh, yeah, you can it's go ahead. It's already suffering enough. I'm joking. You can go ahead and try that. Uh, you, so you're walking over behind it and turning it off? Uh, I mean, like, not even like if it's if there's like an open compartment and stuff like that. I can you can I use like my thieves tools to like bust it open and start like prying apart stuff. Um, as you walk behind it, you don't see an open compartment, but you do see kind of on the back of its head a panel that you can maybe open. Uh, make me uh, a I... athletics check to see if you can pry it open. I'm using my thieves tool. Can I use my thieves tools with it or no? Uh, to break it open, yeah. Want some help, bud? Do you have you have proficiency in athletics, right? 
No. You do have proficiency in thieves' tools, so make me a thieves' tools check, I guess. It would be probably... Yeah, flat check. But it's 19. Uh, so. Taking your thieves' tools, you... And kind of open it with a metal... And the Warforged kind of continues to like... But as you've opened the panel, it's kind of stopped. Its arms shaking in place and its voice lines seeming to have stopped. You've opened it, but also put it into a stasis-like state where you do notice it's now notably louder. You hear behind you from the door... Is there just like an off button I can hit? Uh, not that you could see, but you... As you're looking at it... Actually, make me a... What would I... Investigation check. Okay, we do that. That's a good one for this. That's a 14. Uh, it's its brain. I mean, if you stabbed it, it'd probably shut up. <laughs> yeah, I'll just... I'll, I'll, like, I'll, like, uh... I'll flourish a dagger and just, like, jam it right into there. Uh... Is your dagger made of metal? Yes. Uh-oh. Is its handle made of metal? No. Okay. Uh, as you jab this dagger into the uh, Warforge, you notice kind of an electric shock go up the blade a bit. But luckily, oh. since you're holding a wooden handle, this stops the conductive energy from coming up and unluckily striking you. But as you make this stab, everybody else standing there, I imagine everybody else is like looking at the shelves, looking around the room. Uh, you all hear a very loud clang. Uh, and the Warforged eventually gives the good old and le leans down and shuts up. Uh, you see, you hear now, Augustine, with you standing the closest to the door, you hear now, Hey, the, the clerk is shut up. What? It's not supposed to do that. It always runs whenever one of us is patrolling the shop. But none of us know how to shut it up. What? Why is it? That's strange. Uh, and you begin to hear uh -oh. the turn of a knob behind you um augustine's like quickly like tapping like the metal on it and like making sure everybody can see him and just like mouthing the word hide okay oh, we're hiding i'm invisible <laughs> i have, I have my you're invisible I have you're good i i mean, will pop my sword. yeah i will have my sword which is not a spell or a attack so all right hmm. um, well if we're it's also hiding. invisible if we're hiding okay so everyone's hiding yeah. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What if? Hold on. Are you see? Yeah. Before we're hiding, it's passed without a trace time. Yeah, have you, you've got yeah, one trace. action to use. Yeah. To hide. What about bonus action? Oh yeah, but I make sure everyone else hides. I'm a, I'm, I'm a statue. So you're, I'm standing here. You're using pass without <laughs> trace then. Yeah, the rest of everyone else gets um plus ten to stealth. Oh, so and you're Are just you sure? not moving. Yeah, no, I'm just like standing you're just freezing up. I'm just, I'm just um, statue. all right. I will be ready to uh, if anything goes off to Malcolm, try to attack it. All right. Wait, so, so what does that mean? Everybody uh, has plus, plus 10. ten to stealth. Uh, On top of what we already yeah. have. Yeah. In top uh -oh. of what you have. Yeah. Thirty-one. Augustine. Yeah, have advantage on them. Okay, Augustine, you're hiding. Everybody but Malcolm Jesus is hiding. Christ. 31. All right. That's That's a natural 20. Oh, 37. Oh god. Okay. All right. 20, 37. Damn. <laughs> I know it's so hard. I'm joking. Right? I'm joking. It's so hard as a level 3 mastermind. Mm. Who has advantage on X and stealth checks? Alright, so 30, what, 37 from Augustine, 31 from Haven, the rest of you? Don't be so Malcolm. see me. Uh, Zero's invisible. I was just so like, I'm invisible. I, okay, but you, plus, you don't have to. I have a plus two to stealth, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah but okay. you have plus ten because it passed without trace. Plus so plus 13? twelve. So plus twelve. Kiwi, did you get a thirteen? Kiwi. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. That's um, that I'm gonna use Master of Tas to, I'm gonna use Master of Tactics to give a, a help action with a bonus action. Alright. Huh? Go ahead, Kiwi. That roll means again, you roll, please. you roll again. Take if it's if it's lower, uh you take the thirteen. It's lower than it can't be lower, that's a natural one zombie. Oh, Lamau. That's why I did that. That's a one plus two. What did you roll this time, Kiwi? Uh thirteen. 
In total? Hello? It, no, no. Okay, 30, 30 so you got 25. So 25. Okay, you said it. would have been, okay. been, been very funny. Uh, uh, so, so, from what, so, from what I understand, let me get this right. Uh, Kiwi rolled the lowest, everybody else rolled in the 30s, and Malcolm, <laughs> you're just standing still, and Zero, you're also standing still. I'm invisible, Zero's yeah. Invisible. Okay. Uh, Haven... Yeah, I'm kind of stumbling a little bit. <laughs> he just disappear. <laughs> Haven, gone. Haven and We're Broth, gone. you managed to get good hiding spots behind the shelves. Broth, you kind of like trip a little and make a very loud like kunk sound on the floor as you find your that hiding place. Well. Malcolm, you're just standing there having spent a bit of time to cast a spell <laughs> so everybody else would be able to hide. And Augustine, you roll you roll under the shelf and cling to the top of it and kind of yep. squeeze your way into the top of the shelf so that the goblins that burst out out of the room can't it's see you. We're four, in great hiding spots. Four goblins. Oh, I, yeah. Four goblins been, come out of, of these this room holding spears sticky and um holding spears and one of them is like holding uh this very gross looking pie, kind of browned in nature. Someone Ew. clearly failed it. And this one in the back is holding the pie while three more come out with spears kind of looking around uh mm. the back one kind of takes a bite of the pie and goes <laughs> yeah. the chieftain really doesn't know how to make these stupid pies well that's because none of us can read well you think the chieftain we elected would know how to read i'm not the one voting for him whatever fine i think i'd be a better chieftain anyway would you shut up invaders here we need to deal with this. Two of the more silent ones go off to look around. Uh, they go look on the left side of the room. Augustine's with your flawless 37. One of them just looks under the desk. You can see his head poke in. Uh, I will give you one action to do something if you want to oh. with the 37. What do I want to do? Do you want to do you anything? You don't have to. I, I, you can pass this. There's a part I, of me that's... There's a part of me that wants to just choke him out so he just can't be seen. So there's one less to deal with. <laughs> Spy mission it, just shove it. Hit me in it! Sorry. There's a part I of me that wants men. to. Um, Hit men. Yeah, what would I have to roll if I wanted hard, to like sorry. choke him out so he went unconscious? Um, I'm gonna say you must make a grapple check and then the goblin will have to make a con check to see if he, do if he passes out. Um... Hmm. In the meantime, he passes gonna... out without a trace. Shut up! <laughs> shut, up shut up! Shut up! Okay, shut up, Adam. No. Um, if you don't mind as well, I'm gonna make some checks real quick. For who? <laughs> the goblins. Yeah. They have like passive right. wisdom. They have to pass. Oh, they do have passive wisdom. Here. Active. Unless you're actively searching. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm doing it for Malcolm, so. because Malcolm's standing there. Yeah, I would like to oh, repeat okay. that I am next to Malcolm with sword ready. If anything gets close enough, I, like, preparing to attack, I will kill them. Okay. I will attack them. <laughs> oh. Uh, continue oh, with I what can, you were saying, Cedar. I can talk Are you gonna um, try to grapple? Uh... What do I need to? What would I use if I'm grappling? Uh, you're going to grapple him, and then the goblin has to make a perception check if, or not perception, a con save if you grapple him to see if he stays conscious. Um, no, I mean, like, what am I? Am I using athletics or acrobatics to to? Grapple? Uh, grappling, I think, is just like an attack roll. If I'm wrong. Uh, yeah, it's like an attack roll. Isn't yeah. there a grapple? Yeah, is it just he like has grapple? to. He has to. Like I'm gonna strength. say roll it with advantage because he doesn't know you're there. But if you fail both times, or no, if you hit, he has to then try to resist it. Okay. Well, uh, he's probably gonna have a hard time with this one. I got a 21. 21. <laughs> uh, yeah, he got a grand total of two. You've got your arms two. around this goblin's neck, and he goes. He doesn't get a chance to make much sound before you've got your arms around his neck and are choking him out. Uh, he does not succeed on that con save with only a four. After choking him out 
for a good couple of seconds. The other goblins don't seem to notice he's like being choked out. They kind of look at him and go, Jerry, you fucking idiot. Stop making those noises under the table. You're not going to find him that way. Um, not noticing the arms around him. You're kind of holding yourself up with your feet on the, in the, uh, under the counter, but I'm really you, pulling a Spider-Man. Eventually, eventually, you just like get your arms around him, choke him out. He falls onto the ground, his spear uh, almost clanging to the floor, but getting stuck in the counter. Um, he falls oh in front of you, unconscious, as the other three exit the uh, the counter. Malcolm, you notice that luckily you serve as a great distraction for the other three for the other three <laughs> goblins as they immediately vault the counter and uh, um zero is the sword visible? Uh no, it is invisible like me. Okay, great. They just see this earth genasi stand in there and they're like, "What the fuck are you doing in here?" Oh, hello friends. I'm here for the 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 job opening. We boarded up the door. What are you what? what? Oh wait, what? Oh, so I'm really sorry. I my, I must have got my uh, at the restaurant. I'm I'm deeply so sorry. Roll, I didn't mean to trespass or anything. Roll me deception, Malcolm. Okay, okay. Um, that is a fucking hell. It's an eighteen. Uh, <laughs> the goblins. Terrible. The goblins kind of look amongst each other. The two with spears out, Among? and the one eating pie, like kind of. Oh, oh, that's, oh, wait, no, I know you. You got hired to, uh, to help us make the pies, right? I think the chief yeah. said something about doing that. He might have finally gone through with it. Yeah, I, I believe this is the right place. I mean, um, I think so. Well, what's the name of the bakery you're looking for? I mean, could be the wrong one. Um, oh, sorry, the, uh, I got the details so, like, crisscrossed in my head. Crisscross applesauce. Uh, Grammys country? No, that's the pie I'm trying to make. Um, that's not the. Gosh, no. You notice is the one eating the pie kind of cocks his head at you. That's not. That's not the name of it. Yeah, no, that's the. That's uh, a recipe I'm trying to learn for a friend. It's a different baking endeavor of mine. No. Uh, what is the you, fucking you, name of this bakery? You're supposed to know the recipe before you get. That was a whole point of what the chief had said. Hire a oh, relative. No, I, I was told I'd get like training on site. I was told it's one of those kind of deals. Unless, again, I am at the wrong place. I don't mean to intrude if I'm at the wrong bakery. Roll me deception again. Oh boy. Uh, that is a 16. Uh, you're kind of a little less convincing than last time, but the three of them kind of turn to each other. And, and the now one of the ones with spears out and not eating pie asks you, how did you, uh, how'd you find out about this place anyway? You know, I mean, you had um, to find the job application somewhere, wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah, well, um, I was given a map. Uh, a map? To, like, one of the, the nearby bakeries, yeah. Um, a this map was the... to a bakery that's been shut down in our territory? Um, yeah, that's, I don't, I don't want to tell you guys, I'm just going off what I was given here. I was, like, referred to this job by a friend. Um. You sure, so... you sure this friend didn't, like, prank you or anything and tried to get you killed by a bunch of savages? I mean, I mean gee, I, I hope not. That wouldn't be. Well, well, um, I mean, just, ideal. just like from where I'm standing, you know, you're in a goblin run bakery. They're trying to get the pies. You get a map, you know, you're down on your luck. I mean, you look like you're down on your luck. And, you know, oh, you're I mean, trying to oh, that's find. A, that's a whole other story. You're trying I mean, to I find tell a you job. That whole other story, if you want. Well, well, no, you're just um, trying to find a job, and they send you to a goblin infested place thinking they're going to murder you. I mean, that just sounds like something I do to someone I don't like. Well, I wouldn't think, like, just because you're goblins, you're trying to kill me. Well, well, no, of course, but like this friend people. might have thought that. I mean, yeah, I mean, Listen, that is I, I, I'm not sure how you broke the door, frankly. We don't really care. It's something we can easily fix. If you just, I don't think oh, we're actually hiring. I think you've been, no. you've been duped. Hold on. No, 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 no. Hold on. Sorry. That door wasn't broken. Well, well no, me. but we that put... That was, was open when I got here. <laughs> I think. Roll me deception <laughs> again because he was most no, definitely. No, no, hold on. I didn't break this. Yeah, that's persuasion. Oh. That is truth. Okay, yeah, no. Uh, 
persuade well, them sure. because you are right. It was open when you got here. <laughs> yeah. I broke it open, but oh, that's a 19. Uh, okay. Well, yeah, we're not sure. I mean, we're not blaming you for breaking the door, obviously, but I hate, I, I hate to I cut just... you off, friend, but I, if this door was meant to be shut, I think. I think you might have trespassers. Well, yeah, that's why we're concerned that you're standing there. Jerry! Uh, they kind of yell back to, um, the counter, like, uh, to call their Shit. friend. <laughs> Augustine, he's the one knocked out right below you. Jerry, get out here! Shit. I'm sorry, Jerry. Oh, a bit wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. I oh. have Master of Intrigue. I can, I can mimic their speech pattern. Okay. So I can try and, I can knock them off. All right. What are you gonna say? So to his them? name's Jerry. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm I'm just taking a little nap, Saul. So. Wait, why are you taking a little nap? We just woke up. Hey, um, again, sorry to interrupt, but look, I came a long way, and obviously I'm at the wrong place, and I was kind of yeah. right for this whole bakery thing. But I do have uh, work experience in like the whole like combative. Uh, field. If you guys want help, no, no, trying to we... flush out any like rats that have broken well, in. And... Well, I'm no, happy we've had help. control over charge. this place for a couple years now. We've done a pretty good job. We're thinking of reopening it. I mean, you know, keep Ooh. selling the pies again. It's just we're trying to learn how to read. That takes a long time to develop. You know, it, it's a process. Listen, uh, we could give you directions to Candle Keep. I'm sure they have a nice town there uh, with a better job that isn't our place because you know we're we're very close knit we're secretive jerry get the fuck out here are you i mean listen Just give me a minute i'm trying to get up oh my god i i'm not i'm not someone that keeps a lot of company i'm a i'm pretty lone wolf type i've got not many more attachments to why, people why are you so them. why are you so keen on this we're like like, I mean, um, honestly, when I saw you standing there, I did just want to stab you immediately, but I, I now I'm feeling, listen, like, more inclined. Listen, man, it's just after Helis left, Sorry. I've been so... I've had so little to do with my life. It's been really hard trying whoa, to find whoa, okay, a sense of okay, purpose. Okay, okay, listen, I'm so listen. I'm a simple-minded little creature. We only have, like, one goal right now. I'm not equipped to deal with this, so... <laughs> Again, I all I can recommend is you go to Candlekeep. They've probably got a nice therapy go office there. To therapy. <laughs> you go to therapy. Bar. Yeah. Um, how close are all these goblins to Malcolm? Um, they're about ten feet away. The backmost one is standing right by the counter, <laughs> eating the pie in his hand, while the other two are a little closer. Can I? Can I get out of my spot as quietly as possible and just, like, try to get a good aim on this one guy behind, like, right in front of me? While Are you going to try to kind of, like... Are you trying to choke him out? Yeah. Uh, all right. Roll me stealth and then roll to grapple. I will do that with advantage because I didn't need to last time. There is a invisibly point. wiping the, the tears from Malcolm's eyes. <laughs> uh, that was a... <laughs> That's advantage and my stealth. That is a dirty 20. Uh, all right. You you managed to sneak up behind them, but I will just gut in to ask. Broth and Haven, I haven't given you all a chance to do much. Do you want to do anything what? right now? Oh, me? Yeah, anything me? at all? Oh, yeah. Can I, like... Can I, uh, what is it? Where's my little, my little, not my little, not, not my little goober, but the other thing. Your other thing? The other thing. Yeah, can I do the manifested mind this thing? Uh, the artificial little... mind. Are you gonna talk to it? No, I'm gonna send uh, oh, okay, a on. little, spe this little spectral mind over to where, uh, <laughs> over to where what's his name is. Augustine? Augustine. Yeah. Okay, wait, 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 hold on. Let me, let me find out. So wait, you're sending it over? Yeah. The mind to manifest is a tiny spectral presence hovering in unoccupied spaces within 60 feet. That's just Order of the Scribes! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, so okay, what, what do you, what do you, what do you so want you're the, gonna be... what do you want the mind to do? Oh, I want him to use guidance. It's like a cast oh. spells from him. Oh, okay, oh, okay. Genius! Okay, <laughs> alright, yeah. 
Uh, I'm gonna say the mine, since the mine can talk to you, I'm gonna say it's spectral presence can talk to Augustine. Uh, and Augustine, as you see this little mine kind of, uh, apparate next to you, you kind of hear, Oh, dude. Uh, so, look, best place to get their neck, you know, right around it. Get your arms nice and, uh, nice and <laughs> tight around their neck, especially if they're eating. Actually, maybe not if they're eating. It might choke and, uh... Make a sound. If Augustine wasn't so trained at this, he would swat that thing out of the sky. <laughs> uh, this does give you guidance for your grapple uh, check, okay. so go ahead. I will add that, because I do think I'm going to need it. God, if, if Sarah care, care about, if Rob would not be seen by anybody, he would just help you down and give a thumbs up. <laughs> That's a 19 without even adding anything. Yeah. What, what is it with adding? Things? 24 in total. 24. Oh, 24. the goblin got a nat 20. <laughs> What's the addition to add to it? Um, well, it's to avoid, so there isn't. It would be dex, because it's a. Mm, no, grapple. I can't remember. It's just to avoid the grapple. Um. But I will say it's a nat twenty though, so it does beat yours. Um, but I won't. I won't. Yeah. Getting a getting a nineteen. Well, okay, it's a nat twenty. All right. It is to avoid. It, you don't. Twenty four actually. Sorry. There's nothing to add on it, but I will say it beats it. Uh, I I won't say you don't get your arms around its its neck. You do, but as you do. <coughs> the pie that it had in its mouth came flying out and two of the goblins just turn around to see you with your arms around their friend's neck and their friend missing hey, what, I am what, what the fuck are you my, doing what if i had my instincts that fast <laughs> yeah what if i'm I going was to fast enough when they're not looking uh zero's going to uh silently and invisibly walk up to one of the goblins and uh swing down the rapier i just just on one of their head uh, just going to attack, yeah. All right, which one, left Yippee. or right? Uh, let's say fucking right. Okay, because the right one's the one that's turned around yelling at Augustine. The other one's yeah. still looking at Malcolm. Cool, that's fine. Um, okay. Um, does a twenty-seven hit? And that most money? definitely does. And so I get to do three damage rolls because oh. it's a savage attack. Because I get to add an extra die. Oh, that's so yeah, three d eight. Plus five. Uh, that's a good old 20 damage. Uh, yeah, you fucking skewer his little head in. Uh, he's dead on the spot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and freaking I... a zero just kind of, it's like, it isn't like a slowly upright, just like a, and they're back. <laughs> and they have like this, their rapier, like through the goblin. Uh, the other goblin sitting next to you immediately sees this, and now that you've killed his friend, is mad at you. There aren't enough to really, uh, you know, constitute combat, so... Uh, I mean, I, does could they... just, I could just rapier that last one behind you. The other one is... Not behind you, behind The other me. one is out of your melee range. Uh, Panda, does a dirty 20 hit? Yeah. Alright, hold on. Uh, you take 8 damage as... As you back into existence, the goblin next to you pulls out his spear and jams it straight into your side. It doesn't really go very deep, you know. It's just the tip of it that kind of jams into your side. But now that you've alerted this goblin, it's making an attempt to avenge its friend, but not to the greatest um, success. Like I, like I was saying, am I... How close am I to this other goblin I was trying to Uh, You are attack. about 15 feet from it now as it moved. No, it okay. wouldn't have needed to move. Actually, no, it would have needed to move to attack zero. All right, uh, so how far away? 15 feet. 15 feet? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, I will. You know what cats are the bag already? Uh, Augustine's gonna just get out of his spot, sort of just dash, like, not dash, per se, but, like, jump over the countertop and just, like, skewer right through the guy that's right in front of, uh, uh Zero. The one, uh, you're just leaving the one that was eating pie? Oh, the one oh, that was eating pie yeah. is still there? You the were you choking, choking him! Yeah. Oh, yeah, then I'll just do him first. Oh, okay, you're just killing the pie-eating one. 
Because I would have. Because what's it called? I have. I'm uh, still. Because he does he see me still or no? Uh, he knows you're someone's behind him. I'd also like you to keep in mind he's completely unarmed. <laughs> That's all right. He has the pie in his hand. Nothing else. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Are you giving it in the work room? Yeah, five. sure. Okay. I'll just use a few of those. Uh, does a 23 hit? Uh, yes. Alright, rape your time. So Zero is now looking at Malcolm, just kind of like, do I kill the other one? <laughs> that oh, do you want to kill the other 11 one? damage. Alright, hold on. Let, let, let the two of them. Um, you two were saying something? I oh, know, like, Zero is just looking at Malcolm, like, do I kill them or do you want to kill them? Malcolm? <laughs> I mean, I'm different. Why don't you show off what you can do? That is not in voice. That's just like a, a like a That's kind of a look instead of a word. A look. Malcolm is. Oh no, Malcolm. Zero is still not said a word. Alright, All right, continue, sorry. Uh, Augustine. 11 damage, right? Yeah. Uh, you like how Zero did moments ago, skewer this poor guy right through the heart. Uh, he, as you withdraw your rapier, he's not dead, but he does fall over and is making death saves. Um, hold on. You can't tell this, obviously, but you can tell you hurt him pretty bad. Uh, the other one has now seen you all, but also realizes there are three of you and one of him. And he kind of just takes the spear out of Zero and is just like holding it up to defend himself. Uh, Haven and uh, Care Broth, you can. Oh, yeah. Care oh, Broth Haven. is just like just now peeking out. He's just like, oh, that's mm -hmm. crazy. Ooh. What? Huh? Me? Care Broth. Do you two Care want off. to do something before everybody else does? Oh, no. I mean, I guess I could recall my little. This is some, some okay. sectional goober. Bring him back over to me. Returns. Do nothing with that. It returns to you and gives you a little Go remark of. That guy, that guy did not know how to choke someone. I specifically told him, you know, not to do it with food in his mouth. Yeah, well, yeah, I'll be okay. It's okay, oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep me around for nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm a grouchy, sour fucking puss. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> literally. Oh. Um, <laughs> My son is more positive. He doesn't talk. What uh? What do you all do uh, about the last one left? Uh, is Haven doing anything about it? No. Okay, uh, Zero's just like, this is just for flavor, but I say Zero's just gonna like, like kind of kick them slightly, and then just like pull up their hand and just kind of an orb of like green goo, like full, like forms in it, and just like basically throws it down onto okay. this guy as I use poison spray. <laughs> oh, okay, you're poison spraying him? Uh, make a constitution spray. saving throw, zombie. Con save. Well, you need to roll the hit too, don't you? Or? No, okay. it's a con save. Con save. Uh, that is a... Three. That Ooh. failed. It's gonna take a d12 of poison damage. Alright, roll me that d12. Uh, take 12. Oh, he Full just... Buff. He Don't just immediately, it. like... You see him go stiff and just... Plunk, fall flat in his face. His spear falls oh. with him, but not onto his face. Zero looks at Malcolm for any sort oh, of approval. That sucks. Two oh. thumbs up and a smile. <laughs> Zero smiles and then just kind of like realizes how they look and they just like kind of bow slightly. Oh! Oh! My um, little heart. Standing in this room, now no goblin is, wow. uh, is awake Moonlight. right now. One of them is choked out and knocked on the ground, and the other two are either dead or dying. Uh, I'll disapparate my sword. Well, actually, three of them are dead or dying. Yeah, yeah. one of them is literally just taking the sleepy. And you what? now stand in this room with <laughs> no, I, with, sorry, the background is getting to That's all the goblins crying about how much they <laughs> lost their friends. <laughs> Um, but now you all, now you all stand in this room, uh, oh, no. having taken care of all of them. With no threats well, to sight. I told you that there's a lot of uses out of this thing. You guys nearly killed them. Oh, so I remember little, little just, guy. Zero just nods. Thanks. Good job, everybody. What about the pirates of it? Yeah, we'll get there when we get there. What did you say? The pirates of it. Oh, yeah. The piss recipe. Oh, that's just a gonna... different thing. 
Zero is gonna just like slowly step quietly over next to Malcolm. I'll just stand there, Malcolm. Like, like wipe off the blood with like a little cloth off his uh, rapier. Yeah, I guess sorry about the little guy, by the way. He's he's just my little guy. It's kind of a Did he help? No, yeah, he, he, you you learned to love him. It's okay. That I don't think I can live to love a lot of things. I never loved my mother, but she's my mother. That's nice. You want to talk about it, or...? That's I mean, not going to like talk about it. Let's get the recipe. Let's get the recipe. Okay. Let's do that part first. Uh, yeah, okay. I will I mention, that. standing yeah, in this room, you haven't a clue where it might be. Yeah, we kind of killed the guys who, uh... Oh, I mean, like, like, one of them's, like, is this guy still alive? They mentioned, the, one? They mentioned the chieftain would know, so... Augustine, oh, you do remember there is one in this room not dead. Oh, there is one that's not dead. Uh, I might have to wake him up. Uh, you gonna... uh, Augustine's gonna, like, think for a second, like, trying to think of, like, what we could do, and Augustine's like... Let me get a little friend out of here. And you can see Augustine's like going underneath this desk and just pulls out like a fully alive, like to sleep. Oh. Uh, I'm going to say make oh, an athletics uh, check for let's that. Let's wake real him quick. up. Sure. I'd love to. 16. Uh, you kind of have a tough time pulling him out from behind the counter, but you manage to slug him over the counter. He only takes about one point of damage as he kind of. <laughs> falls nice. on the floor over the counter. Uh, oh. It doesn't wake him up, though. Uh, I never so, said I was a good lifter. No, Zero. no, no. That's, that's fine. Zero's gonna right, start walking slap over. Awake. Oh, Zero's gonna start walking over to the body. Start to, like, half pull out the sword after, like, from the nothingness. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then like, slowly one, put it back one. in and step back next <laughs> to Malcolm. Slap, slap <laughs> awake. We don't kill, we slap awake. Okay. Like, wait, 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 wait. Don't slap him. What's he gonna do if he, you know, wakes up and you know? Uh, good to move around. Just turn him up or something. You guys got rope. I got rope. Everybody's got rope. Burglar sacks are great. <laughs> I don't have. I, I know I have rope. <laughs> Most yeah. people have rope. But they use the sacks. I am up already. Then. Yeah. Let's okay, tie him up. Tie him up. Let's tie him nice up. Little ball on the sky. Uh, yeah. who's tying him up? <laughs> I'll do it. Roll me performance okay. because I don't I know have what a else. Plus to... seven to perform. I don't I know what else to make you roll to determine expect. how good you tie it up. Slide of slide of dirty twenty. I don't dirty use slide 20. of hands a little. I'm I'm talking about performance as in like hands. as in like not as in like the performance of art, but the performance of a activity or task. You can make it a performance deck. You can say that to fucking everything then. You gotta no, no. perform like a killing. Hands. Sleight of hand. I well, just, it's a dirty 20 if it's sleight of hand. Uh, you tie him up good and you've now There's got him. Of... You've now got him on the floor fucking hog tied. Great. Slap him. Just slap him. Just him up here. Uh, Actually, maybe okay. poke. Like, don't like try to. Gently or are you just like smacking the shit out of Forcefully. him? Forcefully. Oh. Uh, he rolled a two on the con save to stay asleep. He immediately wakes up after the first one. He goes, ah, 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 on? ah. Creepy man on the table. Shine. I saw it in hand, like reverse script, what? looking at him. Where, where, where are all my friends? What's going on? Oh, don't worry. What? They're, oh, okay. oh, they're, they're fine. You're uh, going to tell us where that pie is. Where do you have him, <laughs> where do you have him set up? Right, uh... Let me think here. I probably probably would have put him in the center. Uh, okay. So if he looks to the, basically, I'm asking if he looks in any direction, which body can he see? All three of them. be like dead. They're dead. What did you do? see like all They're sleeping. It's sleeping. Sleeping. That's actually just cranberry sauce. What it's the... for the new pie recipe. Okay, we, we don't use blood. cranberries in the pie. It's, it's just. Who said that I didn't do it? I oh no no. What are you gonna do to hey, me? Do you want to focus no, no, on hey. that and doing that, or do you want to answer us, or you'll end up? Wait, what do you want? What do you want, please? Recipe. Oh, Where's the what? Pie Where? recipe? Where's recipe. the re um, recipe? Well, well, okay. Where's the so, pie recipe? Uh, uh, um. Uh, roll me intimidation now? with advantage. 
Everybody. Uh, you know what? It, it, standing above them with a sword. Roll as a group, so if three of you succeed, you succeed. <laughs> Nat 20. Nat 20. Uh, 25. 25. That's not a Nat 20, by the way. Still success. Only three. Yeah, okay. So. Three, <laughs> three of you succeeded. Dirty you 20. succeed on intimidating him. What, what did Malcolm get? Jeez. I'm curious. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, wait. It. <laughs> <laughs> Malcolm's, uh, Malcolm's just kind of standing the there. Shoulders. Doesn't really know uh, how to do yeah, this uh, intimidation Reba, thing. Malcolm. <laughs> One good cop, the rest are bad cops. <laughs> um, all of you surround <laughs> this little <laughs> goblin, on Jerry, on the floor and ask it where the fire recipe is. Okay, okay, the, we, the full recipe isn't <laughs> exactly down here. Uh, okay, get to the point. Okay, half of it's in the office, and he kind of notions to the door to the right, uh, behind, uh, next to the counter. But we we don't know where it is. We just know it's in there, and we don't really have the time to look. Okay, where's the other half? Chieftain keeps it up in Grammy's apartment, where she used to live before she died. I don't know. I, well, I, I, can I, we kill him now? Please this don't kill me, please! I thought it was. Please. No, we don't have to kill him. Leave, um, leave, leave that one alive. I already killed all my friends. I'm gonna point up with like a questioning look when he says the like granny's apartment. Uh, if you all, it, as he mentions that, you do all remember on top of the bakery floor, there seemed to be, it seemed to be as if though the roof had like walls yeah. around it and there was another little sub building on top of the roof of the place. What was Malcolm saying? Oh, I was gonna say I'm proud of the guy for using his words, you know? Like, <laughs> He's go gonna on, kill Jerry. me. Proud of you. All right, let's get him out of here. Wait, what are you doing with him? Can I just lift him up by the, like the hog tie? Mm -hmm. No. Uh, roll... Come on, back, back and take him with you. Uh, I was thinking about that honestly. Are you Super taking mean. him with you? <laughs> don't, don't. I don't he'll he'll, 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 he'll make intentions if somebody else is finding some shit. I don't want to deal with that. I mean, I mean, I like making a. Like making a. I don't give the fuck what you like. We're not bringing him with us. What? What are right, we? Then he's dying, and he just oh. immediately grabs his knife and just dagger and just like right in the heart. Roll for damage. I'm not gonna say roll to hit. He's hog tied. <laughs> Zero jumps slightly, but then like goes back to being. <laughs> you guys kill a lot of people. <sighs> Don't fuck with small folks, apparently. Haven't we only killed, like, four? How many were there? Four. four. I, I didn't touch any of them. I just didn't hit it. That's, that's uh, more than enough people to count that's for That's 12 lot. damage. Uh, 15, he, actually. You get him in the heart and he goes, ah! But shuts up shortly after as he lays on the floor bleeding out. Well, Damn. Is everybody yeah. looking right. at Augustine with that look, like, really? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, you work, as, my you, look, you work as a smuggler, you gotta make a few hands dirty. Okay, so office or apartment first? Recipe. I like kind of point office. to the office. Office <laughs> kind of, it like, is! Lightly office, points to the office. Dagger. You're all heading in? Let's go to the office. Alright, let me get the office map. <laughs> Zero is following and staying close to Malcolm. Heading into the office, Surely you means nothing ominous. You notice, uh, you notice over to the left, of, the right of the room, several bookshelves with papers strewn all across the floor. Various writing on each paper. Some books are on the ground. Uh, the middle way of the office is very clean for some reason, but on the right, left side, you see several desks that all are. So one of them is seemingly in its normal position, but the other chairs are kind of moved around. Uh, uh, pushed around. A desk is flipped on its side with its legs facing toward you. The room is a bit of a mess. Recipe. Well, let's get looking. Let's get recipe, please. Well, let's start moving. I want to make a pie. Alright, are you all investigating the room? Yeah. 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 Alright, yeah. who's investigating where? Table. Uh, can I give the health action to Malcolm instead of doing it myself? <laughs> sure. Um, Looking at plus zero investigation, minus three perception. <laughs> You're using a health action. We're all just going to different corners. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is it, is it like lit yeah. up at all? 
Uh, the room's lit up by the same light cantrip system that lit up when Zero oh, first man. teleported into the shop. Um... <laughs> who's- so- I see. Who's Something investigating like where? On the bottom right of your map, why not? I'll do the, the bookshelves. <laughs> I'll do the top right. Uh, okay, you're investigating the bookshelves as well. Um... Yes. So then that- so... Broth and Malcolm. <laughs> Malcolm, you're getting a help action, so... Okay. That's advantage, right? Uh-huh. Oh, that's my investigation. That's nice. Um, where... Sorry, I have an ad on the stream, so I can't actually see the map right now. Oh, they can uh, picture for you real you know quick. How, you know how it is, the They're... grind. It's in general. Uh, let's uh. go check that real quick. Recipe. Uh, wow. I'd probably say, like, what are the things on, like, the, the left side, like, the little rectangle? Those are the desks. Or something? Uh, I mean, I'll check, I'll, like, rummage around the desk, sure. Alright. I'll look at the desks that he does Okay, so I'll say that, uh, Kiwi, you're investigating the top two, Ice, you're investigating the bottom two. Aye, aye. Yeah. Alright, everybody roll your investigation. Malcolm, do it with advantage. Alright, I got a <laughs> ten. Yee! <Yippee>! Twenty-one! <laughs> The Get on wisdom and intelligence. Let's go. Okay, wait, wait, wait. One at a time. One at a time and slower. Augustine. Seventeen. Broth. Dirty twenty. Okay. Haven. Twenty-one. And Malcolm was a ten. Um. Ten. Malcolm is a ten. Okay. <laughs> Augustine. <laughs> Augustine and Haven, you're both looking around on all the books on the floor and the shelves, hoping that they might be, you know, a book with the recipe inside. But as you look, you don't find the recipe, but you do find several books laying about that seem to be accounting books. No one was cooking the books or anything here. In fact, it seems as if though, with your limited knowledge on how accounting works, that business was booming at the, uh, at the bakery. Ten years ago, seems as if though if I, the bakery's long been know, my... shut down, and well, it's just not been running since then. There's no records here that are any later than ten years ago. Seems the bakery's been shut down for a long time. You also find a lot of dictionaries on the floor with pages missing, uh, with distinct bite marks made into them. Uh, you can only assume what this might mean. Um, Mal. Malcolm, you... or no, sorry, Broth, you're looking around, you know, the desks atop, you notice the one that's sitting in the perfectly normal position, and you can't really find anything from this, you know, you do find in one of the desks some pencils seemingly left untouched by the, uh, by the goblins, and in another desk, you find a little dagger that probably shouldn't be there, I mean, definitely don't usually bring a dagger to work. Do you want to take it? Here you pulled up the whip. Broth? Oh, yeah. Uh, alright. Make me an I'm arcana check. Sick. Yeah, for sure. for sure. Oh, wait, actually, can I ping, like, detect magic? Uh, sure, you could do that. <laughs> wait, pinging detect magic? How does that work? Hold on. I'm just using detect <laughs> magic. I'm like... <laughs> oh, you're just casting. Just you're just magic. casting yeah. a spell. Okay. Uh, this dagger is magical. What? There's nothing that's else crazy. magical in the room within range, however. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Uh, this dagger up. is a plus one dagger. Enjoy, Kiwi. Yay! Uh, Malcolm, you go looking around the desk, and as soon as you open one of the drawers, uh, a poison dart just comes flying <laughs> at you. I need a deck save. Aha! You follow my craft card. Can I give help with Never that? Mind. Uh, no. I'm Brown. gonna say no. An eight? Hold an on. eight. Uh, I'm gonna say that fails. Is this. <laughs> I don't fucking hope so. It's an eight. <laughs> I don't know how else it could be. Be concerned <gasps> if an eight passed. You are struck by this poison dart. Uh, I'm gonna you need a con much. save. Struck no, it's poison dart. So exciting. Whoa. That, except I can't roll for shit. Um, that's a con? Seven. Mm -hmm. A seven? Oh. Uh, you oh, take, oh. you take, let me find my d12. 
11 poison damage, and you are under the Ooh. poisoned condition for the next hour. But as you open the drawer, you see what looks to be a very well-placed, flattened out half piece of paper. At the, It's half piece of paper, hamber hamburger is vertical or horizontally, right? Yes. No. Yeah. yeah horizontal. Yeah. Hot dogs hot vertical. Dog is vertical. Uh, horizontal. Hot dogs hamburger vertical. style oh, no. ripped oh, sorry, in half. Uh, so cut in half, like from left to right, hamburger style. From top to bottom, hot dog style. <laughs> like hamburger and hot dog. <laughs> um, yeah. Right. Like, this yeah, piece okay. of yeah. This piece of really paper kidding. is in very sure. well condition. It <laughs> seems to have been in that drawer for a long time, kept nice and safe by from the elements. And at the top reads Grammy's apple pie recipe. You found the first half. But there's yeah, the problem. The it's only half. All you can make out is Granny Smith apples are a part of it and you got to preheat your oven. Less oh, well, I could have guessed that. Right that. Well, I have some well, good news. What does poison to mean as a condition? Uh, you have disadvantage, disadvantage. on everything. everything. <laughs> oh, all right, get your ass over here. My Yo. ass is going over there. Oh, okay. I'm also following. Right. That's not a... <laughs> you guys are going. I got a knife. <laughs> Very good. Uh, I, I have got a lesser left restoration. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, are you gonna, you gonna lesser restoration, Malcolm? All right. Recipe. That does that remove conditions? Let me look. What's your restoration? This condition and, can be. You touch oh. a creature and can end either one disease or one condition. Which is blind either blind and paralyzed or, or poisoned. All right. Well, uh, Malcolm, even though yeah, you still way. took the burning, damaging sensation in your veins, you are now unpoisoned, so you don't have disadvantage. Do like you need me to I'm heal you too, that. or? I think I'll be good for now. We'll you sure? Yeah. I'll be to tough it out. I've been through okay. worse. Zero's looking at Malcolm, kind of worried. Are you sure? I'll survive. I Malcolm. always do. I roll insight. <laughs> that's that's a sentence I don't want to hear. Malcolm. Yeah. I roll insight. I used. Yeah. Sure. Can I see the recipe? Oh, yeah, sure, I'll hand, um, broth the uh, rest of you <laughs> 24. Very intently. Okay, what exactly are you looking for? To see if you instance? actually need healing after oh, I went out the Well, I mean, I took, like, 13 damage, but, like, I'm not letting that. 11! That's 32. Fucking, is, I'm, cry about it. Um, that's, like, 11 it. damage, apparently. Um. But what are you at, hit point-wise? Oh, yeah, that's the number you're actually looking for. Um, I have like 21 hit points left. I'm good. Okay, that's yeah. not bad. That's not bad. Two so many hit points. Yeah. Oh, that's not bad. Hit points. Okay. I feel oh, you love dumping your con now. And like, dumping your the con. No, it's fine. Uh, Malcolm's dumb stat was dex, so. Yeah. I've been like dumping stuff into it. <laughs> I know, it's so confusing. I'll just keep that in mind. You're good then sense. right now. I uh, will it should be fine. <laughs> Cry. Better level warlock, it's 32. That's nice. incredible. Me. I have 20, 24 Four. max HP, and I've taken I'm really 24. Oh, worse than both of the six. I'm on, the D6 I'm on 16 this? HP. But oh, do you need healing? <laughs> Zero is just looking at you. Zero oh, you, Zero was stabbed. Do you need healing? <laughs> Zero is just looking at you, and there's just like a big pool of blood on one of the sides. How much Sweet damage do you take? Uh, eight. Mm. <laughs> I have... <laughs> no, 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 I'm considering, because I could technically just use my, um, channel divinity and just give you the eight and then give the rest over to Malcolm. True, yeah. yeah. I, I could, I could, I could give you temporary relief. That's... <laughs> oh, I love temporary relief. Um... Helps me forget the bad times. Yeah, I'll just do that. I'll just use my channel divinity <laughs> and All fill right. up yours, which is <laughs> eight. And no. then I'll give the other seven to Malcolm. That's fucking cool. It's... Good job, buds. Yee. Nice. Yee. Yippee. Yippee. 
EFP. Uh, Zero smiles at you, Haven, and like nods. <laughs> More like bows, kind of, but. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, <laughs> concrete. Crazy? Heck, <laughs> concrete. Heck oh. yeah. Oh, I thought it was like concrete. Uh, so oh, I think we should. What? Maybe we should just two shot it. Two shot it. Uh, it. I was I was it. talking I about something it. that was supposed to happen after this, but it seems this went on a little longer than I thought. But that's okay. People have obligations, and there's always a second Friday. No, wait. It'd be the first Friday of the next. There's you get my point. There's another Friday in the future. There's this another Friday in the future. The final Friday. This is Friday. The do final Friday. Do Today do is Friday, Friday in, in California. Friday. Um, California. we will uh, currently Friday in Boston. We will uh, Saturday in the UK. Okay. We will, uh, we will continue uh, this one verse uh, next Friday where we will finish up uh, this one shot. Yeah, verse 1.5. It's okay. Every every time we have to two shot, I'm just gonna call it 1.5 or like 2.5 or whatever. Uh, anyone we want to raid while I fix my well, it's also probably not the best because tonight is the night everybody decides to scream. Kill me. Do you have people to raid? Or? Um, not currently. No, I don't believe I do. I've only got duck. ducks. Ducks? We'll raid the ducks. Sneak snack. We'll raid the ducks. No, I will not be raiding anyone. I mean, hey, Quake only has 34 viewers. No. Who? <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'm just going to raid. Eddie. I'm raiding. Eddie. You could raid Eric, you know? <laughs> I'm just gonna raid Dash Ducks because I don't know anyone who you're talking about. I'm sorry. Crush you don't know who Eric is? No. Luke, anyway, Luke, Luke, everybody, Luke, everybody, uh, have a good night. Really sorry about all the screaming. Um, but yeah, bye bye. People could hear the screaming. It wasn't just my brain. Screaming? Did I just? Did I? I think I sent the raid. It's fine.